Well, hello, welcome to this gun game match on Nuketown 2025. A nice little contest between Killer War Wars, War Ginger, Kusuntai, and the Middle Row. Should be a really good game. Let's start off by looking at Killer Roars. Here he is, starting off with the M27 fully automatic machine gun. Deadly force is authorized. He's moving forward. Seems to know where everyone is. Aiming down the site, ready to get. Unable to find anyone though. Oh, well, it killed by War Ginger. No surprise there, one of the more sadder players we've had in the games in recent years. Middle Row taking it out though. Let's see what he's up to. Oh, takes out Killer Roars in dramatic fashion. Gets put on the MTAR full of all the machine gun. Now let's have a look at some type getting a kill. Oh, Emil Rogue takes out Killer Rolls. Killer Rolls getting a bit angry there on the mic. Uh, he gets taken out by Simtite at spawn. Not a very good day so far for Killer Rolls, but Simtite gets his, taken out by Killer Rolls, gets his own back. Killer Rolls in last place. It's a hard to kill. Warden drew a sad cheap kill on him. Killer Rolls in last place. Currently in the house, heading outside near the truck. Looking around a little bit. He's seen someone get killed by Warginger again. Let's have a look what Warginger's up to. In second place, just off of Milver Road. Oh, instant locking onto Milver Road there. Some would say that's suspicious, and maybe we should investigate that after the match to see if there's any foul play. Just taken out by Milver Road though. Milver Road in first place with the SWAT 556 burst fire machine gun. Fails to kill Killer Roars in those circumstances. Bit strange, Milver Road. Maybe the victim of some hacks there, we're not too sure. Simtite in last place, just coming out the house. Gets taken up by Killer Rolls. Killer Rolls getting back in the game now. He's dead. Oh well, now he's back in the garden. Heading into the garage. Let's go look what Warging is up to. Oh, dead. Look at Simtite, let's see what she's up to. Simtite now in the garage, heading outside to the garden, back into the house. See someone. This is the first one shot. Somehow it doesn't kill Warginger. Warginger taking her out. Very. Skillful shot there, perhaps, but we're not sure. There are possible hacks involved. The Suntai had taken out a middle road. Now he spots a middle road who is in first place. Heading into the house. Heading outside. Seeing someone by the, the bus. Heading through the truck. Sees, ward, sees Killer Rolls fire. Takes out War Ginger. Now on the LSAT light machine. Now he's taken out by the Suntai from behind. Who is now on the M8A1. He gets stabbed by the middle road. Oh dear, she's been knocked back. Right to the first gun, the M27 full of automatic machine gun, that's got to be bad. Must be really upsetting her right now. What did you get a bit upset there? See what he's up to? He's... Oh, a few technical issues just there. See whose fault that is? No one's apparently. Oh well. Back into the house we go with War Ginger, sneaking out outside. Oh, somehow detected... Oh! Oh, Fenn just get a kill there. Real bro takes him out. Now, since like killing a middle of the road, let's see what she's up to now in second place. Camping behind the red car, how very sad. It could work, no, it doesn't work well. Middle of the road takes her out. Now, middle of the road on the XPR 57. No, he's dead. Warginger on the Scar H, free little Mac machine gun. Taking out a middle of the road in the garden, switching to the MTA after all, and machine gun heading into the garage and outside to the bus. Let's see what Killer Rose is up to in last place, following Warginger. Kill gets stolen. For some reason, doesn't shoot Kasun Sight, despite the fact that he's just walking behind her. Very poor show of skill there by Killer Roars as he heads out into the middle of the map again. Takes what well, fails to kill Kasun Sight. Oh wow, Killer Roars failing miserably there. Not a very good day for Killer Roars in last place. Gets taken out again, Kasun Sight on a roll in second place on the SWAT 556 burst fire fly machine gun. Hiding in the garage, see someone! Kills him through the wall! Right through the wall, very cheap tactic there. FAL SOW say well, it fails to knife the sniper, but kills the middle rogue anyway, gets the next gun, takes out Ward Ginger, hammer or not, she's still in second place just behind the middle rogue who is still on the XPR 50 sniper rifle. But as we are well aware, middle rogue not quite that good at sniping. But he's still sneaking around his map, but Sintai is still killing. Now because Sintai on the QBB LSW full of light machine gun. Heading outside, unable to find anyone. Oh, the Warginger takes her from behind. A very, a very iconic maneuver by Warginger, shooting people in the back. It was sort of his trademark, as he has a Type 25 sneaking up on a middle of the road. And stabs the air, stabs the air again. First stab gets a middle of the road, shoots Killer Roars. Now on the M8A1, a middle of the road now. A middle of the road in second place. Kasuntite in first place. Warginger is taking out Kasuntite. Mordinger in the second place, third place. 
we are hearing some talk of Wardrid using screen washing hacks to try and get the edge in the game. A thorough investigation will be conducted after this as Wardrid gets taken out by a middle row. Let's go look at Kasuntite now, who is in first place, camping in the house of the MK48 light machine gun. She's walking outside now and unable to find anyone. Wardrid, the killer roars. In fourth place, I'm taking out Kasuntite, going on the Scar H4 iron machine gun, heading through the house on the outside in the middle of the map. Sees Wardrid just fails to kill him. This has not been a very good day for Killer Roars. Let's go to Emil Varog. Emil Varog's dead. Let's go look at someone else. Back to Kasuntai. First place in the garage, in the house. Heading outside. Full light machine, light machine gun. Turning around now. Sees Dull. Oh, Wardinger with another tactical kill. Still could be foul play involved in Wardinger's history. Now back to Killer Roars in fourth place as he enters the house. Back on the MTAR. Tell Wardinger of a kill, headshot apparently, but I can see bullets not going to the head, but what a question is now. As soon as I take out Killer Roars, go back to her. Now she's on the SVU AS sniper rifle, and this could be the downfall of Gesundheit. She is not a heavy sniper user. She sees Wardinger, no scopes and misses. No hard scopes, misses again. The middle of the road takes out Gesundheit. Sounds like he's like, I'm middle of the dead, let's go look at Wardinger. Entering the house, see someone on small names. Names again. Gets the kill of Kasuntite. FAL DSW semi automatic now. The middle of the in the back, taken out there. Gun promotion SMR. Let's have a look at Killer Roars. We just got killed by a middle rogue after killing Wadinger. Now in the alley, heading down to the middle of the map, sighted someone, fine, fails to kill a middle rogue. Killer Roars still in full place. But perhaps not the best of days for Killer Roars when it comes to competitive gaming. Kasuntai like camping in the house with a sniper rifle now, let's have a look at the map. Oh, Kasuntai gets taken out. Have a look at the map here, we can see a middle rogue in the middle of the map. Killer Roar's coming out to meet him. And watching to Kasuntai in the back garden. Let's see what they're up to. Warginger cheaply killing Kasuntai, and the middle rogue taking out Warginger. The middle rogue now in first place with the RPG, failing to kill the easiest of targets in Killer Roar's. Fails to kill him again, Killer Roar's takes him out. Respawning. Well, Killer Roar's taking out Wardinger. Let's see what he's up to. In last place, we're making maybe a comeback. Three kills now on the FAL ESW semi automatic machine gun. See someone but walks away completely stupidly. He must be quite blind. Now Wardinger's are taking him out. Oh, a middle rogue blowing Wardinger up. A middle rogue now on the crossbow. Could this be a middle rogue's day? Could he get the victory here? Oh, oh, God. God. Killer Roar stabs him though, knocking him to third place. He was so close. His dreams have been crushed. What a terrible day. Now on the SMR semi automatic, looking for some kills. Probably really upset, we don't know. I have seen crying. Kasuntai in first place, still on the SVU AS sniper rifle. Fails to kill Warginger whilst aiming directly at him. He takes her out. Warginger now in second place, on the same SVU AS semi automatic, aiming down the size moves. Sneaking up on Killer, Killer Roars, quite aware of Warden just cheap ways and takes him out. Let's go back to Kasuntai, aiming down the scope as well. Completely blind to the person in the truck, looks and he's gone, just staring at the bus. Warden with the kill, Warden now in first place, because Warden to use his sad tactics to get the win, no, Killer Roars takes him out. He's been known in the past for Warden to get victory, he's very cheaply. He intends to come up from behind on you, very convenient in times as well, perhaps when you're reloading, but we're not too sure. Killer Roars now on the SVUAS, Take, taking shots at Warden, but hits the no scope, missing all those hard scopes, but sees some no scoping. Mill Road taking out the Sentai's Killer Roars comes down the alley with his next sniper, the XPR 57 Auto. Gone! Gone! Eventually kills a Millville Rogue after a few spray shots, now on the DSR 50 in bomb action. Far takes two shots to sight the type but now on the blister with iron sights. Perhaps one of the stupidest guns we've seen in the game. It gets taken out by Wardinger, who is now in second place, trying to no scope, failing. The Milver Rogue gets the kill. Milver Rogue in first place, third place, sorry. Oh, takes out by Wardinger. Just no kill of roars after getting your kill on Kasuntai. Kasuntai now in last place. We thought she may have a chance here. Could this be her moment to get off the gun? Misses a few hard scopes. Finally gets the Milver Rogue now on the next sniper at the XPR 50. But it could be said that hope is lost for her, and she is again not a very good sniper. That's just how I'm gonna put it. After missing all those hard scopes, I just 
You can't really say she's that good with it. Killer Roar's in first place with a crossbow, aiming down the sights as he moves, aiming at a mannequin for some reason, tries to get hit by a shot, misses. God, misses again on this time. War Ginger takes him out. Our pursuit from behind. RPG completely misses Kasuntai. Wondering how you can miss with an RPG. Eventually gets the kill. Now on the crossbow. War Ginger in first place. War Ginger on a ballistic knife. One of these cheap ways get him another victory. He's the oh, he gets Killer Roars. War Ginger with the sad victory. <laughs> Killer Roars losing his temper. The real Baroque coming in third place with Kasuntai. Despite being first on most of the game, coming in last. Look at this game winning kill. That looked like it could be an aimbot. We're not too sure. We'll have to look into it. But War Ginger with a cheap victory right there. What an epic game for Call of Duty. Well, I hope you've all enjoyed yourselves. And we'll be back at some other time with more gaming goodness. Goodbye.